And today we're playing the beggar. Left stick to move. I'm not using mouse. I'm not using control. No way. He's the door. Am I the beggar? Am I? Am I the one that was lying down here? I think I was. Someone was. Like someone was trying to get me. I can't say for sure. Do you have a flashlight? Well, I'm a, I'm a beggar. I probably don't have a flashlight, do I? Oh, what the? What the hell was that? Oh shit! Uh oh. Uh oh. What the hell was that? That was wonderful, though. Oh. oh. Sorry, sir. Well, here we are. Hoyle tells the beggar. This is supposed to be a really good game from what I've heard. What is all this? Can we do anything? I guess I can't pick anything up yet. We open this door. That door's locked. Inspect. Let's inspect this thing. What did that robot do here? In a few hours, a humanoid called Morvan will assault you due to your exposure to the toxic Vene Vene de Bozic wine. You are safe for now. Morvan is a product of your imagination. Giving it a name helps to shape it when, it's, when the inevitable conf confrontation begins in the future. Go through the air duct next to your cell and look for my next m next missive. Okay. Looks for his next missive. I guess he's leaving his messages here. Go through the air duct. Okay. Could you give me a flashlight too? I would like that. I mean, I can see fine, but, you know. I just feel naked without a flashlight in these kind of horror games. Oh, what was that? Was that something coming through here? Huh. Let's interact with this thing. What happened? Oh. That happened. Is there anything else over here? It's dark over there. I can't see. Can't see nothing, so I'm not gonna go over there. Oh, it's a secret wall. Little teddy bear. Mouse is everywhere. I hear him. Squeak, squeak, squeak. Now I'm guessing we're supposed to have some sort of like superpowers or something. So I'll be quite excited when that happens. A hole in the ground. Oh. A dead body. The monster in the basement is real. Is that? You don't have no powers yet. I just saw my hands pop up. What do we got? The basement murmurs secrets. A door. Oh. A little rat. I want to pick him up and chew him, I think. Salvation echoes above. Okay, so I don't think we can do anything up here, so let's go downstairs. I'm guessing we got to... What kind of... 
roaches everywhere. Is that, is that a long fall? <gasps> what is that? Is that us? Is that like what we were doing? We were being wine beggars. I heard it had something to do with the first game. Is it something called wine? I haven't played it. I, I put it on my wish list, so if, if I like this game, I'll go back and play that one. If they're similar. Dark over there. More wine drinkers. I like I like a, an occasional wine. How about you guys? Red wine, something like that. To me, all red wine tastes the same. What is that? They all taste the same. So I usually usually just get the cheap, uh, five dollars for a big jug kind. Because whether I buy the expensive one or not, it seems like it's. To me, they taste the same. Space bar to jump. Wine of wonders. Sip and wonder. Kind of want to drink some wine now. What's this? Inspect it. There's a reason I devoted long years seeking you. Such prolonged exposure to toxic bandy bandy de buzz I, I don't know what's it uh, bandy de basic wine not only means you hallucinate more than but also certain facilities or faculties we need them to win the war. For the moment, direct your focus. Extend your hand and cause that box to levitate in order to proceed. You can grab objects. You can use these objects to reach places you couldn't reach before. You will only be able to pick up medium or large objects. Okay. How do I do it? Okay. Grab it. Okay. That's pretty cool. I finally got some power. There's a door over there. That's where we came though, right? I think we have to get over there because... Or... Let me get over here far away from it so I don't look like I'm holding it. I've got powers. I'm the beggar. That's a new superhero name. The beggar. Can we do anything in here? You can just totally bypass this door. Kind of unlock it, though, for next time. Two ways to go. One way to go. Or maybe I... Another two ways to go. Should we go this way first, I guess? Yeah, I thought I heard a voice. Locked. Are there any keys or anything? I'm not sure what to expect, really. I'm guessing we're going down here. Sorry for my rude language, beggar. I have a brain tumor. My politeness module got fried by the mother of king son. By the mother of and son, huh? A flashlight is what I want. Uh, okay, so I shall gradually reintroduce you to the powers you have 
little by little, and just the absolutely necessary ones, the next of which is your capacity to levitate distant objects through concentration and hand gestures. You can attract objects that are far away. Once the objects are close to you, if they are large or medium sized, you will automatically pick them up. Okay. It's like, this is what I was doing already. What the hell? Oh, I'm not picking him up. I'm just dragging him to me. Okay. I got uh, magic powers. I always thought like if I ever got like, you know, superhuman powers or something like that, I would do good. But just from what I've seen this far, so far in this game, I'd probably be an evil one, I'm sure. I go to my head so quickly. Let everybody worship me. Nah. I'm only, I'm only kidding. I think. Alright, so. Adjust my microphone a little bit. What do we have over here? So we have superhuman strength, but we can't jump. Or we can jump, but not very good. Unless I were to go like this. There. But do I want to come up here, though? I don't know. Did I finish exploring everything down there that I wanted to explore? Let me go find out. This is where we came from, up here. Yeah, we're not getting back up there. And this is where we originally came from, okay. So there, yeah, we're going back over there. And that is what we're doing. Slowly but surely. It's all coming back to me now. Little by little. Now I guess there was a demo of this game too, but I, I missed that. I missed that opportunity. I guess this fire doesn't hurt us. Let me crouch a little bit more. Can we go in here? No. Oh my god! What was that? Another thing here. It's inspected. You possess the ability, ability to propel objects at extraordinary velocities. Capable of causing destruction or harm, this necessitates my caution and distance, for I cannot entrust you due to your hallucinations. Okay. You can charge grabbed objects. If you release a charged, if you release a charged object, you will throw it at a high speed. You can use this to damage en enemies or break certain structures. If you hold a charge object for a while, you will start to take damage until you die. I don't like that. Okay, so... What's that noise? Is that electricity near me? Alright, so let's grab something we can... Okay, so that's how I'm charging it. Left sip to charge. <gasps> okay. Did I kill a mouse? I can be careful of that power. 
I'm extremely powerful. Death to anyone who comes near me. Through bad. So far, this game is a uh, very compelling. Oh, it's too dark over here, though. Oh, oh, mouse, can I get it? I can't pick it up. Oh, I wanted to pick. I should be able to pick up that that mouse. I'm gonna pick him up and throw him across the room with high velocity. See what happens. I want him to go splat, splat all over the place. Hmm. I guess I can't do it. I was gonna, I was gonna pick that thing up and, and throw it at him at least with velocity. Oh, where did he go now? Oh, there he is. And I missed him. Okay, let's just get out. Hey, I, 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 I was here before. I know you. Can I pick you up? Oh no, I can't pick you up. I can pick you up. Uh oh, I can get through here, through this thing here now. Uh oh, didn't do it long enough. Lord, eh. the power I yield. Salvation echoes above. The monster in the basement is real. We'll find out. Yet I can't pull this door open. All these powers I have, I can't pull that door open. Or can I? No, has no effect. Well, <clears throat> that's odd. That's all I gotta say. I got super superhuman strength, but yet I can't break that door down. Give me a little mouse. You are smarter than you look. Continue onward, my dear dysfunctional beggar. I'm smarter than I look. You don't know me very well. Oh! I don't know if I want to go... Uh-oh. Oh, I guess I'm down here now. Smarter than I look, huh? No one's ever said that to me before. I feel special now. Oh. Well, that was pretty dumb. Jeez, I think I broke every bone in my body there. things. So far I haven't seen anything to uh, like pick up or anything other than objects to throw or move. This is, what does he want to tell me now? Remember when you face Morvan, dispatch him with whatever means at your disposal. Regrettably, I am unable to lend my aid as he is a mere creation of your own psyche. We know this happened to others decades ago during the toxic wine hallucination crisis. The sole remedy is to com is to confront him or meet one's demise. All right, so we got battle with our own mind, hallucinations and such. It's uh, it's awfully dark in here. This is where we came from. So, <gasps> where do we go next? I'm not see anything. So we gotta confront this thing, but somehow. Okay, I don't see.
see a way to go. So, there must be something we have to do in order to get out. Oh, I think I see it just now. Well, I think I am smarter than I look. Man, footprints on the ceiling. That's vampirish, to say the least. I don't know where to go. Left shift to run. What's... I'll be running from something. Footprints everywhere. Some language, I'm not sure what it is. I'm guessing it's the Terra Rato Castigo Divano Adios Mundo Cubrada. I guess, I don't know, maybe that's Spanish. I'm not good at other languages. So I'm not as smart as I look to uh, Emma. But it sounds evilish. Castigo Divino Adios. I think adios means see you later. That's the only thing I know. Adios, amigos. Mundo. Cubrata. But it doesn't sound good. Divino. That sounds like it's like we're gonna cause divinations or something. Oh, shit. Footprints everywhere, except for on the ceiling, just on the walls. Oh. Uh, they want some mod effing, don't they? Oh, hell yeah. Some major mod effs going on right now, I like it. I must say. I'm guessing we're going down there. Yep. Into a soulless room. Hold to interact. Hold it. Uh oh. Because I gotta hold it till it opens and I gotta get, out, get through it immediately. Alright, there we go. So I'm smarter than I look. Barely. What is this? That's one of those thingies out here. Inspect it. That is our designation. Beneath those totally stable skyscrapers, I maintain an underground laboratory. From there, I can cure your hallucinations and establish contact with those who reprogrammed me to facilitate your salvation. Regrettably, our path is not linear as the world has fragmented it in, into kilometer long pieces. The exact cause of this rupture remains elusive, though we harbor suspicions that the Bane de Basics mine played a role. So we're going over to the skyscrapers, huh? Over there, so one of those things, huh? I want more powers. I thought you were going to give me some more powers there. I could use that, really. Can't pick up that thing. That thing is by two heavy for me. Hope nobody's below. It'd be very dangerous to throw things over like that. Kill people. Whoa! Get out of my way. I don't want to fall. Man, what happened here? The whole world is shattered, I guess. Uh-oh. Are we supposed to go? Are we supposed to? Go on this ledge? Oh my god. I don't think we have a super jump strength. Oh 
shit. This reminds me of that game we were playing with the, uh, the rig. Still. Deep. Something, I can't remember the name of it right now. It's got a strange name, that's why I can't remember. I can't... Oh, there, let's go open the door! I couldn't do that before. Okay. But I feel much better now. I feel like I can probably maybe jump that. Maybe. Anything else we can do over here before we get over there? I don't know, that's kind of a long ways, don't you think? Here we go. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Phew. Let me get back a little bit. Gotta be able to do a little bit of a run, right? Ooh. Get out of my way. What would you guys do if you had powers like this? I mean, it's easy for us to say, yay, yeah, we're going to be superheroes. But who would use it to make money? Who knows? Okay, I don't see anything we can do. Oh, no. I don't see anything we can do here, for sure. What is that? Okay. So it's a possibility. It's only way I can see right now, anyways. Too far there. I hurt myself. I don't know my own strength sometimes. I'm thinking we can just walk across. <gasps> no, we cannot just walk across. Crap. We gotta jump. We just gotta do it right. I'm so afraid now because we over jumped it one time. It's not a laser beam. No power. No power. Two green lights. Oh, there's another one there. Okay, I can't touch that one. Okay, so I got two red lights. Does that mean I got power? I got power now. 
Oh, I do. Okay. Hold to interact. Hopefully we're supposed to come out here. So there's a lot of popcorn in this game. <gasps> well, apparently. Uh, uh, I can't get up there. What's, what's keeping me from getting up there? Were we supposed to? Were we supposed to come over here now? Okay. All right. We're supposed to come over here for sure. door is open. How about this door? Oh, this door is open too. Can I push these things off? People are out, out there watching the world fall apart. It's very dark. Another door. Leading to another floor. Excellent. Can you imagine this, this being like sitting on your porch and then just falling in the depths of the abyss like that? That'd be quite, be quite frightening. Like being in a, falling into a sinkhole, like left mouse. You're in proximity to Australia. Huh? There, I shall impart knowledge of a magnitude akin to that of a formidable brain cancer. See. Australia. I don't know if this is going to work or not. No. Nope. Maybe we can... Okay, so let's take a look around here. Maybe we can't do anything in that room. Uh oh, okay. I think I see now. Let's, uh... Fly, fly this plane. There we go. Fly this thing out. Into the world. I'm not sure. Uh oh. I'm not jumping off that thing for sure. That's crazy. Superhuman powers. I like it. You know, because if you think about super, superhuman powers, if, if we actually had the powers, it'd be like that TV show, The Boys. I think, be, I think that would be more how it would be. Something like that. My opinion, though, of course. Looks like we have one way to go. And one way only. What is this? You also possess the ability to eliminate through hand gestures and better concentration. You are indeed a breathing flashlight. The darkness shall not stop you from now on. You can eliminate the stage around you using telekinesis. Left mouse button. Okay. Alright. Oh, I like that. Finally, a flashlight worthy of us. How long can I use it though? Did we come? Okay, no. We open this door, okay. It is quite dark down here, I can assure you that. Well, 
wine of wonders, sip and wonder. I think that's why. I think that's what happened to us. I think um, because we were like the homeless or whatever it was, we drank all this wine, and we are became like what we became. Right, let's take a look down here, I suppose. We get us up into over here. What is this? It's a fuse thing. Okay. There's one right here. Oh, so now we need two more. What, what, what does this operate, I wonder? We need two more fuses. Huh. There's one right here. <gasps> what the hell is that? Okay, that's a... We got a powerful imagination, don't we? Oh my god. I wonder if we could have thrown this at him if it would explode. I mean, it's a propane gas, right? Or a tank? It's probably an empty one, though. Let's see. Anything we can use now. We gotta get those fuses and he stole one of mine. It's not very well. Not very nice of him. Oh, there's one right there, though. Now, where am I at compared to this thing over here? Is it over here? I think. There it is. Alright, so we need to find one more. I thought I was going to fall up over there. Oh, there's one right there. Oh, there's another one right there, too. So we got plenty of them around. I don't know what it goes to. Let's 
Let's see. Let's follow these lines. I think I see already. Here we go. So we're not getting up there. Uh oh. Well, we're not going down there either. Oh, I see now. Oh lordy. Let's get on down there, I suppose. A key. First time, first time I find a key in this game. Let's keep it. I like having this flashlight. Left mouth. What's it say? Left mouth. Uh, left shit. Okay, the charge. Did I use that key? What is this now? Nobel Peace Prize awarded to scientists who discovered the origin of the toxic Bana Bana de Bostic. Wine, ever since Xavier Rogue, descendant of the heroic Albert Rogue, during the wine pandemic of the two centuries ago, and his team discovered a, a few months ago that the toxic, toxicity of wine actually came from a unique type of me metallic moss. The scientific community took it for granted that they would win the Nobel Peace Prize, and to no one's surprise, they did. The team discovered that the mo this moss harmless in natural amounts, grows under the Earth's surface. It managed to get close to the roots of the Bandes Bandibasic vineyards. It was then when the roots absorbed the properties of the moss. Then, in the cellar, it matured and expanded microscopically inside the wine, thus enhancing its properties until the first bottles were opened decades later. Rorg dedicated this, the award to his great-great-grandfather and assured that in a few weeks, the first preliminal, pre preliminary results of the metal moss study will be released to the world. He announced that the results will re revolutionize the field of neurology. There's some shit in that wine. Get out of here, get out of here. I wish I had the ability to fly, that's what I really want right now. God, there's a lot of stuff up there. Mm. Hopefully we don't have to come back down here because I think we're going to be screwed if he did. Maybe we have to go in there. I don't know. Let's find out. I'm guessing so now. Seems like this is the only way. How long these fires have been going? For years and years and years. So 
I'm sure we bought the cheap wine. I, that wine pie was cheap too. Oh, electricity. I'd be careful with that. You could have been electrocuted there. another day maybe where are we at now follow me or your deficient skin will get barbecued by the sun my dear albino beggar I'm following you look at this oh what the hell Time to get there, I'm not gonna be albino anymore. I'm gonna be barbecue. Oh, I'm getting the shade though. Can this Keep shake the shadows to unburn? To unburn, okay. I'm unburning right now. Let me find some more shadow. Where'd I gotta go? I thought we were, is that not where we're going? Or maybe we went to there already. Okay. Where'd he go? Oh, I see him now. Any oh, what's this right here? I'm dying of thirst. I was driving my van home to my house in Broken Hill after taking paint to a construction site and suddenly Another one of those blinding green lights came flashing on. The biggest one I've ever seen. I don't quite know how to express what came next, but the world has shattered into pieces, and I find myself trapped in this one. I don't, I don't recognize any of the other pieces near me. There is nothing in Australia, Australia like this. I've tried to look for help, but I am trapped. No food, and almost... No water. I hear the desperate cries of people who have been trapped in other pieces. It is impossible for me to, pro to cross. I will either fall into the void or die of thirst. I only pray to God that my wife and children will, children will be alright. Well, well, it looks like you didn't go into the void. You just died of thirst and everything else. Let's go. Move on. Looks like he painted a thing that says help. It's pretty cool. Help never came, no. I'm sorry, mister. Let's run in the shadows now. Should we actually even trust this thing, you know? Even though it kind of like has been helping us all along, maybe. Maybe it wants us to use us for evil things, you know? I look, I've done lost him. Okay, where'd he go? I'm, I'm assuming he's this way because there's, there's a shadow over here. Oh, there he is. Let's run to this shadow. I saw him go over there somewhere. I run to this shadow over here. Did he, he, did, he did come over here, didn't he? I'm not seeing him at all. Where's he at? I hope I'm not running in the wrong direction. But definitely anything is possible. Especially with me. If you guys know me good enough, you know. You know. I don't have to say anything. Oh. 
Something's here. What is this, I wonder? Employ your dexterity with hand gestures to rotate the Earth's crust. Huh? Use this power with caution and only as much as necessary as such dra drastic changes wreak havoc on the rest of the animals and humans on the planet, including those of us fighting the war against the cursed Biomental. Cross the desert using this skill and reach the illuminated windmill to follow your path. You can change the time of day at will. The desert heat will only burn you if the sun is high. Look up or down to select a new time. Right mouse button to change the time. Alright. So now we can get some major, major shit powers. I'm not sure what to do though. Oh, okay. Let's make it, um, how we change it. Oh, I didn't, I didn't know what I did. I don't know what I did. I made it night. And now I wasn't able to select it. I think, unless it was already selected for us. And we can see at night. Because we got a flashlight. I don't, am I going the right direction? I, I can only assume that I am. Are we going to that light over there? Man, I wish they would give me some further direction. I'm a beggar after all. I need help. Is that him over there? There's, there he is. Okay. We can't run very well though. Kangaroo Crossing. Oh, it must be in Australia. So I guess I can harm this thing if I wanted to, right? Powers we weld. Maybe this is how the world got destroyed by beggars like me. Ones who drank the wine, I guess, maybe. Cursed the world, destroyed the world. We got a long ways to walk. I see him up there though. Sure, we're not gonna fall into a giant void. I lost our little robot friend. He's somewhere around here. I guess I'm out of stamina as well. I'm assuming we're coming to this lie. This only seems logical. What's going on? People are fighting. This is where we're supposed to go. Where's our little robot friend? We're supposed to go down that hole. see a way to get inside yet anyways let's see I think we're supposed to jump over right there we go but do we I guess, oh I guess we can get out if we had to looks like we can anyways let's see how Must be losing my powers. That's a long ways down. Still going. Oh, what happened? Hot sun aboard the hot sun in Australia.
Okay. Should we go this way or should we go back the other way with that door? Let's go try that door out, I guess, and see. Okay, yeah, we can. But what are we, what are we supposed to do? Is this where we're going to... This is where we're going to sleep, maybe? I'm not sure what they're doing to us. There's fire. Oh, there's a dead body burning. Two dead bodies burning. I didn't want to pick you up, I'm sorry. Is there anything we can do in here? Can we sleep? I don't see anything to do over here, so... Let's move on. I need to oh. go, beggar. There is something I must convey to our destination under the skyscrapers. You shall be without my oversight for a brief Arrivederci. Arrivederci. all this I'm assuming we gotta get something man it's so dark I don't think there's anything we can get is there I don't think we can go back either This thing here. Get it. Nope. My strength isn't that good. Oh, we can jump down there. Okay. There we go. Uh, was, that, was that a mistake on our part? Jumping down here? I think so. <laughs> oh, Lord. Crap. We shouldn't have came down here. What's this? These puzzles, this is like a puzzle that's going to mean something to us. Well, do we got to change the time again? Maybe? I'm seeing all these, like, suns. I'm, I'm thinking that's what we got to do. Let's, let's try it and see. Sunset. Oh, there we go. Oh, wow, this is... Oh, shit. Need a little tugboat to carry me over now. Do I gotta do it more? Change the time again. get inside and do anything. Oh no. So I guess we gotta change the time even more now. See those birds flying. Oh, I see. Oh. How cool. It's pretty cool right there. The powers of our mind. What we can do to that? Can you pull that? It's like we can just pull that chain or whatever. I don't know. Make a chain! like we're gonna have to do more of that time manipulation stuff 
from what I can gather. Fortunately, it chooses the next time for us. We just gotta push the button. I guess I'll go into noon time. Well, it's not right here, though. But we ain't getting back this way. And we ain't manipulating nothing. I think I'm jumping over there. I think we might have screwed up the time. We'll do it again. Maybe there's something wrong. Come back the night. Bring something over there. Or can we select? Let me see if we can. Oh no, okay, we can. That's where we wanted to go, I'm assuming. Okay, so let's uh, now let's change the time. This world is being destroyed by me right now. Okay, so this is not what we wanted. Not at all. So, let's see. Can we, we cannot choose. No, it has to, it has to, it has to do it for us. So we don't want to be over here, I'm supposing. Oh, you know what? Maybe we want to be... Oh, maybe... Yeah. Okay, so maybe we want to be here on this thing. Duh. We'll follow it over. Right? Yeah. Oh, the sun is blaring, though. There's where we want to go. You just jump off. <gasps> Whoa. There we go. Is that an ancient god? Looked like Shiva there for a second. What happened? Are we moving? We're not moving. Did not do it long enough. Let me see. Let me do it again. Not. There we go. Okay. Yeah, I think we're... I think we're okay, right? For now. It's locked. Oh my Jesus! What the? Ah! Get, get off me! Doomed to repeat that again. Let's not go that way, that direction then. I don't want to go there. It's almost like a Shiva pose. Alright, so I don't see anything over here though, unless we change the cycle again. That might be what we have to do, I'm not sure. Shit, we have to go back in here again. Because we're definitely not going to be able to uh, 
throw anything at him. So I'm wondering, I don't know. <gasps> I'm not seeing anything to pick up. Good old mind effing going on right now. I was, it's like I can't see. Arrows seems to be pulling this way. So I'll go the opposite direction. Guess we're going over there next, right? Or up there, one of the two, looks like. Are we not moving? Something's moving. We're not moving, but everything else is moving. I'm guessing we don't need this right here then. We need to get back up there some way or another. How are we going to get up, up there? I don't think we can get up there, can we? Did we do an F up and uh... Let's change the time. I don't see anything else we can do right now. It's already night time. Oh, okay. I, I, I see. Okay, we can change it. Duh, okay. Um, what do we want? We want... Sunset, maybe? Oh. There we go. We want sunset. We gotta bring it all back, though. Yep, let's bring it all back. Let's bring it back to night time. So we might be in Tokyo or something, some some other type of country. I see like Asian riding over there. Yeah, this is where we want to go right here. And we want to go to Sunset. Interesting. Might have to go over there too. I want that's a. Oh, that's a dip. Okay. Very 
interesting. What's this note I have to say here? Nothing good is on the other side. I locked the door. They were looking for food. They were not aggressive, but they started attacking us after some humans hurt them. <laughs> they have killed everyone little by little and just mortally wounded me. We didn't want to hurt them, but we couldn't stand still either. We regrettably killed a couple. They are not evil creatures, but they are too many of them. They act out of pure instinct and survival. Oh shit, what are we gonna have fun in there? We don't have any kind of weapons other than our superpowers. Needs a key. So I don't think. Let me get back on this thing here. Maybe we'll have to go to like uh, high noon or something. We know night will take us. Back. We're not moving. Nothing's apparently moving right now. Okay, so somehow we gotta get onto this thing over here. I don't think we can do a jump. Oh, well, can we? No. Oh, can we? Okay. We was able to do it. Let's change our time. Back to sunset, right? Yeah. Sunset should take us over there. Whoa! Yeah, be careful. I think it must hit us. Okay, so anything over here? Can't affect that bell. Should be able to ring that bell. Oh, he's got a key. Let's keep it. Let's place that door. All right. So now, I guess we'll have to. Maybe go here, go back over there, and, and do everything over again. I'm, I'm, I'm assuming. I don't know. Let's see what noon brings us. Noon brings us nothing. Bring on the night. Sunset. Now we should have the key, hopefully, to get inside that building. This game is pretty good, I think. Yeah. 
What's in here, though, is what I'm wondering about. Oh boy, the thing goes down. The temple. Find a way to exit the temple. Well, we can go back. Definitely. Oh shoot, we're gonna... We gotta jump down there, right? Break our legs. I'm quite sure. Here we are in the dark. Nice little fire going. And that's gonna be it for me guys on this one. I love you all, see you next time.